table or boo? Or does it not? Boo. Oh, yeah. Okay. This boo? This boo? Back in 1961, uh, A.B. and Maxine Pulliam opened the Jerry's restaurant. When our dad and our mom married, he was on the tobacco market. We would actually move for three months at a time, and I think he just decided he wanted to start a business where we could uh, actually settle in somewhere and be together. He loved this community and loved this town and loved the people, so he decided that he was going to build a restaurant here. He built it, opened in 1961, and we're still going strong. We still got, got a lot of customers coming from out of town to visit us. We actually come here just when we're passing through. We're actually from Fleming, Third, Kentucky. I mean, we get people from Louisville come and get our uh, chicken livers. And Lexington people come down and get beef liver because you can't find it on anybody else's uh, menus. I have to be honest, our general manager, Barry, He's awesome. He started with Dad when he was 16 years old. It, it's a family affair for sure. From the original menu, we still have the J-Boy sandwich, Champ sandwich, uh, hot fudge cake, which everybody loves, and a lot of uh, new items. I have a lot of great memories. I remember when I was young, sitting in the back on stools trying to, and helping my dad make slaw. We have prospered throughout the years, and had a really good following here in the community. Well, it's a small town, you know, everybody that comes in pretty much knows everyone. Every morning, yeah, we'd have the same people come in, you know, sit and drink coffee and just, you know, chat. Uh, there was several Jerry's in Kentucky, and especially here in Central Kentucky. And now we're the only one remaining. Business is as good as it's ever been, really. I just want to thank everyone for coming out and supporting us over the years. We used to come with my family and now here with my daughter and grandson and granddaughter and son-in-law. We're family here. We really are. I just see us continuing to go strong and and hopefully we'll have children who will be interested and want to kind of take over and uh, we're never going to let our managers retire. Ever. 